Well, are men of our generation really more responsible? Are men getting more responsible? Well, I do not know, but let's look at seven things if really men are getting more responsible. So, so we, we would want to really look at what are the major or the primary roles of men in the society. Well, men are supposed to be fathers, they're supposed to be husbands, and they're supposed to, to, to have, I mean, the men gender role revolves around characteristics such as, um, um, I mean, I would think of strength, I would think of um, assertiveness, I would think of being strong, I would think of being able to defend your family, I would think of being able to carry everyone along, all right? I mean, that's um, the primary rule or the modern rule the society places on a man. And I think traditionally men are supposed to be the breadwinner of the family, providing for the family. They're supposed to be the leader of the family and then they need to build their mental capacity to do that. And they also are supposed to be the protector. They should know how to fight. They should know how to defend their family. They should have some characteristics of a strong man who can stand against the tides and protect his family. And this does not come easy. If you want to think it comes easy, I mean, if you're a Christian, you should be a war lord in Christianity to be able to stand against attacks from your family. If you're not a Christian, you should be a mafian to be able to protect your family when the world begins to point accusing fingers on your family. Take this or leave it. I'll give it all I care, but that's the truth. And now, look at it again. Men of this generation, are they becoming nicer or good? I think the men of this generation are becoming nicer, and that is making them weak. Because being nice is a sign of weakness. Etymologically, nice means being foolish. And then if a man is foolish, a man will agree to everything a woman brings to his table. But if a man is strong, a man will not agree to everything a woman brings to his table. And that's what a good man is. A good man makes a woman better, but a nice man makes a woman foolish. And that's why you discover that most nice men are used by women. And at the end of the day, they cry here and then they commit suicide and die. Not because they are not sound, not because they are not intelligent, but because they allow themselves to be carried away by the nonsense of being nice over nice is killing a lot of men in this generation. Take for instance, a woman comes to you around 8 p.m. and tells you, wants to go out, and you ask her, who are you going out with? She says, I'm going out with my female friends. And you think of these female friends and you find out that, okay, these female friends, there are things about them that I do not like. There are things about them that are questionable. And you tell her, don't go. And she begins to quarrel. She begins to fight. And you tell her, go. You have done the, I mean, that's the greatest mistake you have done because, I mean, you don't know what she goes to do there. You don't know what she's going to gossip about. You don't know all of that. So the best thing is tell her not to go. And then you know, you have your reasons. You tell her the reasons. If she can relate with it, fine. If she cannot relate with it, you tell her, well, don't go. And that's QED. Now, she gets stubborn and go. When she comes back, let her go through pains. There are different ways to discipline her. You don't need to touch her. You don't need to raise your hands at her. But there are 10,000 ways to make her understand that she has messed up and she needs to dance to the music of messing up. That's what a good man is. Be a good man, don't be a nice man. Because if you're a good man, your wife will be better. If you're a nice man, your wife will go foolish over time. And this is the truth. Whether you take it or leave it, it's the truth. Now, are men becoming responsible more? I, I, I don't think so because how can men become responsible when the narrative of get money rich at all costs has been popularized completely? And right now, men need to get money by all means, killing people, stealing, doing all manner of things in order for them just to get money. One problem that is changing the men kingdom. Men have refused to go through the process of hard work in order to get rich. Men want to get rich faster these days, doing anything available. How will someone put out this note to get money? I mean, that's crazy. And I mean, some of it, some people are very happy saying it. They are very proud of their saying it. And that's crazy also. But, but that's an, another thing. So how would men, men are really, our young boys spend more time playing games and doing things that can make them better. This is another reason why men are losing it. Most of the guys, oh, sorry, some of the guys that are raised today, you find out that they have mental case, that they are incapable of operating as men is because they are raised by single mothers or single parents. And this thing destroyed the men in, my, in men. And these things are true. You see, the society should stop emasculating the masculinity in men. Because if you remove the masculinity in men, you make them to begin to fall into an identity that they cannot define. And that is why we are losing responsible men in this our generation. So men, it seems to me as if they are getting more less competence, even in workplace, women are really getting more competence these days. That's number one. Number two, you discover that men are becoming better fathers because the society is beginning to make them take the role of nurturing, care, taking care of the home, which is actually the basal responsibility of the, fem of, the, of, of, the, of the females 
So they're getting better in taking care of children. They're getting better as fathers, but they are not getting better as husbands. Because they want to be nice, and nice men don't make good husbands. Good men make good husbands. So it means that men need to sit up in terms of responsibility on the aspect of being competent. They need to sit up in terms of responsibility on the aspect of being a good husband. They need to sit up on the aspect of their responsibility in the aspect of being strong. And that is it. The men are gradually becoming less responsible than our fathers in some areas, and that shouldn't be.